Hi, my name is Parag Bajaria, and I'm one of the founders of Rendezvous. And what we are trying to do is to automate business networking at events. So all of us have shared the experience of going at events and not knowing much about the people who are here. We don't know their backgrounds. Because of that, you know, today at this event, I'm trying to find a social marketing guru who can help me launch this product in January. I'm looking for an Android programmer uh, who can give us the Android client for this product. But I'm sure that there are people who are here who have that background, but I simply don't know how to identify them. There are no tools to give me that visibility into that. So Rande is trying to solve that particular problem. What we do is we take your online profile, we take your social graph, and your intent, why are you at a particular event, and empower with you the information to find the relevant people at events. So our key aspects are matching. We try to give you recommendations of who are the people that you should be meeting at an event. So let's say you're looking for a job and you're an Android programmer. What we do is we go out, find out which companies are hiring Android programmers, and then tell you who are the people here who have that particular, who are from those companies, so that you can go and network with those companies for, for looking for your job. Second thing we do is we allow you to search based on people's profiles and intent. So you can find out, let's say you're looking for a marketing director from computers, computer networking industry who has 10 plus years experience, who has MBA, we will allow you to find those people in the audience. And third thing is we are, mobile. We bring all this information to you on the device that you already carry at events. Information when and where you need it. So we launched this product as a soft launch on iPhone and these are a couple of screenshots. On the first screenshot I'm showing you there are 103 attendees and we have categorized the backgrounds of all these people so that you can quickly find out is there anybody here from Cornell University for example? Who are the people from Cornell University? Who are the people who have business development skills? Just one click away. And as I mentioned earlier, that we do recommendations. We provide you who are the people that you, want, you should be meeting. Then once you see identify the person uh, whom you want to meet, you see their profile. You can chat with them. You can do LinkedIn connect with them. So that's about the, pro about the product. Why is it solve this problem? Well, we all understand. It's a common problem that we all face. It's a big addressable market, lots of events, lots of people going to events. Monetization is viable because look at it, Eventbrite and Meetup, they are both making billion plus dollars in this, in this industry combined. And LinkedIn is monetizing business networking. And we are gonna come up with similar models to monetize the, this particular product. And finally, there is no dominant product uh, that is addressing this need that exists today. Yes, we do have competitors, location-based social networking tools, which are more focused on real-time networking. Uh, they don't really work well at events because before I, want to, before I go to the events, I want to know who are the people I want to meet, not at the event. And what we have found is those real-time discovery uh, apps are more suited for social gatherings rather than professional events. Then there are even event-focused applications who are pretty much uh, one-time use applications, you go use them. They're more focused on the needs of the event organizer, just a way to disperse information, and they lack any social discovery uh, mechanics. So our key points are focus on business networking, focused on event attendees. We use, we give recommendations, and we build unique and differentiated UI. What we are here to do is allow you to do purposeful networking at events. So that's it. Thank you. Questions on uh, how did you determine, so from this audience list, right, what category they belong to? I mean, how, how has the data fed into your system? Yeah, so what we do is we hook on to your uh, existing networks like LinkedIn or Facebook to pull the profile data. Oh, I see. Yeah. Based on the names that you have? Based on the names. So we have two ways that we work. One we call open event, where people check into the event 
We also have a system where we work with the event organizers where there is an opt-in uh, thing where they say, okay, I want to be checked into this event, I want to do networking, and they give the LinkedIn uh, information and then we collect the data from there. Okay, so you're basically relying on the information that's in LinkedIn to come up with a profile Yes. In a, in a particular event. So yeah. once, once you categorize them and put them into different buckets, right? So how is this beneficial to someone you know, like an individual like me? Can you explain? So uh, two things. Now you are here uh, as an investor and you're looking to find uh, good startup companies right, uh, founders, you're trying to meet founders, CEOs. So to are able to identify who are those people, it's one click away. You can look at their title, their, their, their background, and immediately find out is this a person that you want to connect with or not. So before even you come to this event, you are able to identify these are the 10 people that I want to meet. And vice versa, if you see the, the, the perspective from the people like myself, who is trying to meet investors, I get to immediately know that you are, you are one of the persons that I should be talking to. I see. Interesting. I'll actually go back to uh, one of uh, Ramani's earlier comments. The, the two, two challenges I have here, one is this seems a lot like a solution in search of a problem, and I'm not, it, what you've described seems to be a lot of, um, it, it, it assumes that people are going to be very organized about going to events and that there is really is a very widespread need that people want to go and network with as many people as possible whereas my suspicion is there are a lot of people who are a lot more ad hoc and it's more like let's go there and find out who let, let's see who we'll meet so i don't know if you've got any, any insights kind of backing up why you really feel that someone would very proactively reach out and want to do this so uh, what we, we released this kind of beta product in March and we have done live events. Uh, in general, uh, what we have found is uh, the event that I, the screenshot that I was showing you was the event that we did at Cornell. Uh, 300 people at the event, there were 100 people who were checked in and we had only iPhone client at that time uh, available. So there, was, uh, there were people who were eager to go in and find out who are the people there. Uh, we have replicated similar uh, statistics with other e events also. So there is a trend that we have observed. Now what we have observed is, is that this doesn't work at all the events. Uh, they are the events that are more business focused, more networking focused, are the ones that this works the best uh, at. But uh, I should say that the problem does exist. Actually, we have had users come up to us and say, this is an awesome thing. Uh, I, I really, I'm at this event and I really don't know anybody that I should, who, who should I be talking to? I don't want to take talk to random people, especially people who are looking for a job and so on, uh, who, who, who are really trying to reach out. And uh, we have received some positive comments. Not to say that I know the whole, whole story, how, how will this evolve? but we have done some real world feedback. So I have a, sort of a basic question because I'm not an IT person. So it, it's not clear to me that you're using anything that is particularly proprietary or not in terms of the technology that you need to do to come up with what you're doing. So I don't know if uh, this can be so easily replicated by any number of people. So what you're offering is so unique that an investor could fund it and be comfortable that it's not going to be blown away. And more importantly, you know, if you're going to use LinkedIn as your basis for it, that would be your biggest competitor. I mean, how long will it take them to do something very quickly and just sort of uh, do this, right? Because you're fundamentally focused on a, a big competitor out there who's, who's, who's going to enhance what they're doing. So I, I'm not, I don't know, convince, convince the people here that you've got something that's very unique and differentiated, you know? Sure, so the data is just the starting point. Okay, what we are trying to do is try to give you insights that you cannot just get by looking at the data itself. So recommendations, I give an example of a job search, and you can take that and extrapolate it to different recommendations. So what we are trying to build is a very uh, customized recommendation systems for professionals who are going at event. Now can this be replicated by a bigger company like LinkedIn? 
I am sure that the, it can. Uh, could we be an exit to a company like uh, LinkedIn? Probably we can. Uh, so I don't have good answers for you there, but our, our IP is not just showing you the data, it's the recommendations, the, the analysis of the data is our, uh, I should say, high value uh, proposition. I'm sorry, I don't recall. Did you talk about the revenue model that you were looking at at all? So the revenue model, I said, said it very briefly, but it's uh, very simple. Uh, we are gonna follow what LinkedIn is doing uh, for charging the event attendees uh, for a premium service. So there will be a free uh, app where you can do some amount of functionality, uh, but there will be a premium version, where is, which is where we'll provide the advanced functionality like recommendation and search. And the users for that premium features will be sales guys, marketing guys, uh, whoever are, are people that are trying to reach out and go to many events and do business deals. Great. Thank you. Sure. Thank you.